Good Friday evening, Southeast Texas. The drippy, dreary weather expected to persist through Sunday. We may see a little bit of sun uh, here in the Triangle late day Sunday as the rains finally move out. But again, uh, lows in the 40s, highs in the 50s, a little bit of a warming trend on Sunday. Monday is the pivotal day as we return to sunny skies and warmer temperatures after a chilly start. Until we see the, and get rid of this southwest flow aloft, we will stay cloudy and that will probably not uh, take place until this trough of low pressure that you can see off towards uh, the northern tier, the northern Rockies moves into our area, at least through the state of Texas and turns our winds. Notice the southwest winds aloft, but now as we head towards Monday, they become more westerly and that is expected to at least scour out the clouds finally. So putting it into this mess that we've been dealing with. Tonight, uh, if you're headed out, uh, maybe some sprinkles, some light drizzle possible, otherwise cloudy and chilly, no doubt about that. We think the temperatures will get into the upper 30s in the lakes and into the lower 40s in the triangle. For Saturday, again, uh, 20, maybe 30% coverage of drippy, dreary weather conditions as high temperatures reach. I think a little bit warmer than what you see here. We'll probably get into the uh, mid to upper 40s in the lakes to the lower 50s in the triangle. On the Gulf of Mexico, looking at slightly choppy seas tomorrow around 1 to 3 feet and a northeast wind at 15 to 20 knots. High tide tomorrow afternoon at Sabine Pass at 2.16 p.m. and 9.56 p.m. Our forecast tonight, about a 30 to 40 percent coverage. A very light rain or drizzle. Lows close to 40 in the lakes, lower 40s in the triangle with the northeast winds. Not a pleasant night, not a pleasant day tomorrow. We'll go to about a 30 to 40 percent coverage. Again, drippy and dreary, but I think it's going to be a few degrees warmer than uh, what we experienced today. Sunday's kind of tough. I think we're going to see a lot more sun than what you see here uh, up in the lakes area. you probably see a few patches of sun uh, maybe late day on Sunday. It just depends. Otherwise, that's your weekend. Not the prettiest, right? Monday, here we go. The sun returns and it'll do its work as we reach the mid-60s. Fat Tuesday, looking at uh, partly sunny skies, and we pop up or climb to 70. Further warming with dry weather all of next week into the mid-70s by Thursday and Friday. Again, clouds in and out, or sun in and out through uh, the next uh, seven days, especially, I should say, Monday, Tuesday, next week. You'll see um, intervals of sun and clouds day-dependent. Otherwise, looking uh, dry for Fat Tuesday and Ash Wednesday. Download our app, follow us on Facebook and Twitter, and as always, there's more weather at 12newsnow.com.